Soil didn't exist prior to uh, the chemical weathering activities that are initiated by plants that have rubisco, uh, because rubisco is is the gateway for all of the carbon to enter the plants. And then from there, once it's inside of the plant, it's really the Pandora's box of opportunities and possibilities. Plants are really trying to, you know, take carbon out of the air, shove it in the ground. That's the evolutionary sort of um, path that plants have taken. Now, just in terms of more like general metabolic processes, plants always have stored pools of carbon that's available for them to do a variety of different things with. Think about it like a bank account that's that's continually built up with money. Anytime you need to go to the store and buy ingredients to make a sandwich, you've got funds in the bank account that you can go and buy stuff. But if you've only got $5, you can't buy three different things that cost $5 each. And when a stressor comes along, like a bug is crawling around on the outside layer of the leaf, and it bites into the plant, the plant has to form a metabolic response to that. Those were some of those elements could be nitrogen, carbon, hydrogen, oxygen, um, very, very complex stuff here. Otherwise, the plants try to build up their pools, their stores, because they're always faced with different stressors. 